Geobyte. Welcome to Geobyte. Hi kids. Good morning. How are you all? Had your breakfast? In the previous video, we have covered the topic Count to Subtract. In this video, let us cover the topics All the King's Horses and Puzzle. Now, let us get into the topic All the King's Horses. Hey kids! Once there was a king who could count only up to nine. The king loved horses but he could not count all of his horses. He could count only up to nine but not more than nine. So he arranged the horses in such a way that when he counts the horses in each side, they will be nine. Let us see how he arranged. Three plus three, six. Six plus three, nine. Nine horses on this side. And three plus three, six. Six plus three, nine. Nine horses on this side. 3 plus 3, 6. 6 plus 3, 9. 9 horses on this side. 3 plus 3, 6. 6 plus 3, 9. 9 horses on this side also. Now, let us see this question. How many horses in all did the king have? Let us count. 3 plus 3, 6. 6 plus 3, 9. 9 plus 3, 12. 12 plus 3, 15. 15 plus 3, 18. 18 plus 3, 21. 21 plus 3, 24. So, the king have all 24 horses. Let us write. The king have 24 horses in all. Once a visitor with four horses came there. Then it was getting dark. So he thought to stay there for a night. But... The horse keeper was so scared because if the king sees those extra four horses, he will be so angry. Then the visitor said, do not worry, the king will never know. Then he arranged the horses in such a way that in each side he gets Nine horses. Let us see how he arranged. See. Two, five, two. Two plus five, seven. Seven plus two, nine. Now let us count how many horses are there in this side. Two plus five, seven. 7 plus 2, 9. Now, let us count how many horses are there in this side. 2 plus 5, 7. 7 plus 2, 9. Now, let us count this side. 2 plus 5 is equal to 7. 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. Now, children, let us see this question. 
How many horses are there now? Let us count. 2 plus 5 is equal to 7. 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. 9 plus 5 is equal to 14. 14 plus 2 is equal to 16. 16 plus 5 is equal to 21. 21 plus 2 is equal to 23. 23 plus 5 is equal to 28. So, there are 28 horses now. Let us write. There are 28 horses now. Children, at night the king came to count the horses. Then he got nine on each side. So he said, yeah, that's fine. And then he went to sleep happily. In the next morning, the clever visitor tried another trick. He took out his four own horses, but he also ran away with some of the king's horses and left the king's horses in this way. But the silly king did not know about his missing horses. Let us see why. 4 plus 1, 5. 5 plus 4, 9. There are 9 horses on this side. 4 plus 1, 5. 5 plus 4, 9. There are 9 horses on this side. 4 plus 1, 5. 5 plus 4, 9. There are 9 horses on this side. 4 plus 1, 5. 5 plus 4, 9. There are 9 horses on this side. That is why the king did not know that his horses are missing because the clever visitor arranged them in such a way that he gets nine horses on each side. Now let us see this question. How many horses are now left? Let us count. 4 plus 1, 5. 5 plus 4, 9. 9 plus 1, 10. 10 plus 4, 14. 14 plus 1, 15. 15 plus 4, 19. 19 plus 1, 20. So, there are 20 horses left. There are 20 horses left. Children, let us see this question. How many of the king's horses were taken away? Children, in the first, we have seen that the king was having 24 horses. But now he is having only 20 horses. To know the answer of this question, we need to subtract the number 20 from the number 24. That is 24 minus 20. Children, first let us subtract the digits which are in ones place. We have 4 minus 0. Children, now keep 4 in your mind and 0 on your fingers. 
children zero means nothing so no need to subtract 4 minus 0 is 4 itself now let us subtract the digits which are in tens place 2 minus 2 children now keep 2 in your mind and 2 fingers on your hand before 2 1 0 so children 2 minus 2 is equal to 0 so children Four king's horses were taken away. Let us write. Four king's horses were taken away. Now, let us see a puzzle. Children, now we have a puzzle here. Let us see this puzzle and try to answer this puzzle. What numbers are we? If you add us both, you get 100. The difference between us is also 100. Children, first we have if you add us both, you get 100. And the difference between us is also 100. Children, if you observe clearly, if we add both, we get 100. Means it is nothing but 0 plus 100. The difference between us is also 100. That is 100 minus 0 is also 100. So children, the numbers are 0 and 100. So we added these two numbers and got 100 and subtracted these two numbers and also got 100 by doing like this. You are welcome to contact us on Telegram to clarify your doubts regarding these topics. Check out the link in the description. Thank you for watching. Please do like, share, comment and subscribe to Geobyte. Geobyte.